Well, everyone, welcome once more to Play by the Pound. It's been a little while since we've done this series. Cherim Docs, but Cherim Docs heart to Real Lucky is going to introduce this, introduce welcome this video. Cherim plays games playing by the pound, a weight gain in board game series. Thank you, dude. <laughs> Cherim Docs heart, Cherim Docs butt. Yeah, exactly. So, this is Smasher the Will of the w Thix. Will of the Thix. Want to say Wiss? That pun. <laughs> <laughs> this is made by Creature Unknown slash Bloated Goyle, who is in the chat right now. He's a he's a pal. He's a palsy. And he did this for the wake, uh, the the game jam of August of this year. That happened. It was a game jam, but it's, it's the game jam. You get it. But yes, there's a number of those games I haven't checked out yet that I mean to. But uh, let's start with this one. As far as I'm aware, this game is golf. <laughs> Also, I cameo in it somewhere, I think. <clears throat> Breaking news, this just in. We are receiving reports of a strange new phenomenon. Small flame-like entities have began appearing all over the city. Being in close proximity to these entities has been shown to cause immediate, severe bloating, weight gain, and fatigue. People in the city have taken to calling these entities Will of the Fix. <laughs> It's advised that you evacuate the area on the site of one, and to contact the proper authorities. Honestly, sounds like your dream come true. What, you don't think I've noticed you downing those gainer shakes every morning? Are you oogling your gut in the bathroom here? What the hell? It's one of those things, gah! My whole body feels like a marshmallow in the microwave! No, not me! Not my toned body! So someone cut the feed! There's way too much feed there. <laughs> wow, when they said immediate, I guess they meant it. So somebody help me! But please, one of you two! They got my husband! The whole house is infested with those things! Calm down, ma'am. I know just the person for the job. My friend Dakota here. They'd be more than happy to do it. Now go! It's just to list us. Just to list them, yeah. Works out. Just don't give him a choice to make. <laughs> Alright, so, how's this work? So, six par stroke zero. This is mini golf, yes. <laughs> Fat with content, tearing out the seams of fun. Oh my god, epic. <laughs> Alright, so how do, I, how do I play? Do I like. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. So, I'm supposed to get all the fires, basically. Alright, well... Let's just go... Oh, what? That was not very fast. I... I suppose I needed to pull it back more or something. Let's see. That's better. Oh, oh, I break... <laughs> okay, I was gonna bounce off the wall, but I guess breaking through it's one way to do it. Also, Husbando got a bit big there. <laughs> Wobble. So is there actually physics going on here? Looks like it. I'm not going to get par, but whatever. I'm learning. So, like, golf, but I also have to deal with, like, objects destruction. <laughs> actually, maybe I'll get par if I get lucky. I assume it gets harder to move the bigger I get, but... I'm also going to absolutely destroy things along the way, so who knows. Full soft body physics and stuff. Yeah! Oh, stroke seven. So, what is, uh... I'm just going to... Smash to save them. Oh yes, absorb. Oh no, bed physics, bed physics. <laughs> bed physics. <laughs> ah, I see. Looks like somebody made the front page. Local badger saves the day. The paw post. Obesity rates on the rise. Dakota Smasher Johnson sprung to the rescue involving following the evasion of Will of the Thicks and other something 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 who wish. <laughs> Looks like somebody made the front page, both of us actually. But your lardacious midsection, I like that word, seems to be stealing the show. 
You know, the amount that nice old hen gave us as a reward was substantial. We could do this full time. I can get us some gigs so long as you can keep being a vacuum. I can just picture it now. Harley and the vacuum. What do you mean that's corny? It's perfect! Whatever. Just get on the van, you badger blob. We got some work to do. All right, well, let me get par first. <laughs> Bed physics, yes. All right, now that I know how this could, uh, this works as far as, like... Hopefully I can get par this time. I'll just do the same thing as before, but without messing up the first swing. That might go well for me, hopefully. I didn't even make it. Ah! That's okay. I think I have an idea. Nope. Restart. I'd actually recommend not worry about part. At first, the Lux of Skizzle. Alright, fair enough. I. So, does it keep track of which ones I've gotten par on? Because I'll forget otherwise. It doesn't seem to indicate it here, so. But I assume since it says small fry. Hey, are you the person with the paper? The one that saved that rooster? My place has been overrun by those will the fix things, and my friend, well, started eating him up, and now he's all blocked up in the backyard. I'm not saying to cure him, just can you clear up those things before I blow up too? Wisp before. Yeah, I'm gonna 100% it, but I, I'll, you know, I'll do a casual run. It'll, maybe I'll learn some things along the way. All right, well, I see an obvious thing here. I'll wait for the two. I appreciate that time slows down when you're aiming. That's a good thing. I missed. Good work, me. Well, at least I'll drift into the right path. I just go go up, go left, and go back down, I guess. <laughs> okay, well that's... Edge of that area? Hi, Hyper. You're terrible for being late. How dare you? Oh, shark. <laughs> People need guts to live near these things. Oh, that's an unbreakable wall. Okay, gotcha. I guess that's obvious because it's like, you know, purely, you know, black colored, so I guess that indicates not breakable. Yeah, Alexa Shark, he's also in, uh, he's also in, if I recall, he's also in, um, you know, Crab Letter. Ah, <laughs> didn't have enough momentum. They in sharp contrast. Epic is going to town with play by the pound puns now. <laughs> I guess fat does bring itself puns. There's a lot of things you can do with that. There are many puns to gain from this situation. <laughs> now he's stuck in a quarter. Is this a better fate? <laughs> Wow, you make quick work of those will of the fix. Thank you, huh? <laughs> Lexel can go a bit overboard, as you can see. Alright, I'll keep going. Yeah, I guess I'll run through afterwards, sure. Like, try to get the par times. What else is he in? Uh, isn't he in... Yeah, he's your boyfriend. But is... Isn't he also in Tribal Hunter? I thought he was. There's a shark in Tribal Hunter. I might be mixing up sharks, but... Um... <laughs> Hello, mouse. Listen here. I was just trying to run a sale in my store where those things appeared. Now I've got some big blobs fill at my store. They're driving out other customers. I don't care how much it costs. Just do your thing and get it done. Oh, okay. Must be a different shark. What, what is this 80s-ass store? I like it. <laughs> Oh, 15 par, goodness me. 
There's some big levels. It might be difficult to get par with, with it being so many strokes to build. Like, they're not short courses, so it's gonna probably take a few attempts to get par of these. Is there any way to, like, look across the map? What's this one do? Oh. Oh, there is. I can I can right-click Drake. Well, a, a little ways. At least enough to tell me where I need to aim. I'm gonna guess I kind of need to get in front of the elevator. Let's see. Can I do that without... Oh, not... Oh, I can just break the elevator? Alright, that makes... Well, escalator, I should say, but... I thought there might be, like, height here, but it looks like it's a little little more casual than that. That works. A lot of customers over there. And more over there. Okay. Can I just... Yes, I can just miss the wisp. I think one thing that would have been nice is like arrows pointing me towards the wisps so I knew where they were, but... This is the last one, at least. I might actually get par pretty easily here, actually. This level's get hard to get par on? Is it? Well, it depends on where the customers are. Oh, there's one up there, too. Uh, let's go ahead and... Oh no, I'm stuck on the escalator. It does not appear that you can... This is escalating the difficulty. Um, seems like if it, yeah, if it pushes you, yeah, you can't, all right, I see. It really, really stops your ability to move forward. She is a fatter? I don't think it's proper, oh god, I cannot even get around it now. Definitely should have got over there last. Oh well, whatever. I see why there's so many, uh, stroke ability, oh my. The size. Oh, you're actually working further on the. Oh, how do I get. Wait, if the escalator is just gonna stop me, how do I get around it? I guess I have to start with the shark. Or I'm not start the shark. I need to start with that person over there and then go over here. So I did this in the wrong order. I'm actually pretty much soft locked, actually. Soft lock, get it? <laughs> yeah. That's fine. Hi, Key. Of course I missed both of them. You know what? I'm restarting. That was the first stroke. Oh my god. I have no ability to aim. Or time, rather. Blob block. No, I was soft blocked. Blobs are soft. There, that's what I wanted. Okay, now it's, uh... I guess I'll bring the t-shirts with me! That one Kirby golf game. What was that called again? Alright, so learn by lesson. Need to go for the go over here first. <laughs> oh. But don't I need that I need that wisp before I can get anybody, right? So I need to carefully stop. No 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 Let me let me control Thank you Oh god damn it t-shirt The t-shirt is between me and saving you It's fine Oh my t-shirt 
There. <laughs> T-shirts. They cause so many problems, apparently. Clothes suck. Don't wear them. I'm rather surprised I'm not on the L. Okay, I really thought I would have... I'm, I'm struggling to get on the escalator this time. Okay, last time I couldn't get off it. This time I can't get on it. All right. Which is ironic because you think they get destroyed by weight gain. Very durable shirts. And goodbye, Tyke. I'm sorry you had to go already. Okay, the, es the es escalators also stop me... Okay, when you're on the escalator, you can't really can't go any direction, including the direction they're aiming towards. So in other words, I can't even go the same direction as the escalator while on it. I have to kind of wait for it to get off, to get, for me to get off of it, basically. Tubby. Tubby loves weight stealing. Tubby loves the weight steals. It's, it's been a thing for him for a while. I'm just waiting for my character to stop moving. There, I think I think I'm off of it completely. So close yet so far. There. Large lad. That's better than small fry, but I did. A, that was actually a worse part than some of them. Sheesh! Took you long enough. At least you got him out of there. What? Deflate me? How dare you? I'm not been near those things in my form as slitter as ever. I wouldn't dare make all the types of shop in my store. <laughs> Thank goodness you're here. Our laboratory is working on a cure for the current crisis when they appeared. Now the whole lab is overrun with them. Our current experiments have been somewhat successful. One touch of dead post beams, and you'll be smaller than ever. For just long enough to move a bit, but then the size just comes right back to you. You'll find these beams... Scattered around the lab, use them if they might if they might help in your cleanup. Oh, there's there are new mechanics. Also rat. Let's see here then. I like the music variety you chose. Did you make all the music yourself, uh, creature? Or it's not based on par, it's just based on how many wits you get per turn. Oh that's how the story works. Okay. Huh. I that's too far, I need to go back. I see, so it only lasts when I so it only lasts the turn you run into the beam. Oh nope, nope, not what I meant to do. That might work though. Someone who made three songs for the game, then the rest are rolled free. Ah. Huh. Damn it, I was really hoping the other wisp would kind of end up in my way. That worked. Well, that works well enough, I suppose. Um, can I go in there? I'm, I'm, part of me is always where really like, I don't feel like that's a too durable doorway. I don't know, though. Oh, I almost missed that wisp, but I got it. Alright, let's see. Oh, perfect. Well, a little far, but still. Oh, what the heck, I'm just trying to watch over my phone. Oh, that's right, you had to go to bed. Well, thank you. If you have to sleep, I understand. <laughs> of course. Let's see, there's 14 in this level? Alright, I'll just go for this one. <laughs> And didn't figure out where the other ones are. Probably over there. Well. Oh no. <laughs> it was a trap. A fat trap. Seems inefficient. What can you do? Oh, 
Oh my god, but you're so fat you broke out. That is how physics work, fortunately. There's nothing in this- why am I going here? <laughs> there was nothing actually over there, alright. Oh, this is gonna be... Break this door. No? Break the- okay, don't break the door. I guess I go through the heavy- I guess I was supposed to go through the heavy security gate after all. Alright. I assume? I mean, there was stuff beyond it, I just was like, it's a heavy security gate. I don't know if that could beat that. There is a direction you haven't gone to, probably. It would be nice if I could zoom around the whole level with the mouse. Right click lets you look around a bit, but uh... It would be better- I, I, I have trouble getting my bearings in games, so it's good when I have a feature like that. Alright, I can go- well, there's that- there's obviously that way, but I can't come from that direction, so there's probably a route down here I didn't see. Except for I can't go this way either. Oh, whatever. It might be hella hard for me to get par on these courses. Even when I do learn the roots. Uh, that beam did not last long. Yeah, this way. I didn't go this way. I thought it was just a wall there, but that's kind of obviously not. Cool. I'm in a, I'm in a wind beam. But, oh good, I can get through that one. Unlike, unlike escalators, wind does not push me as much. Expand. <laughs> Not quite. Should wait. Ah. Okay. Ah, oh, that opens the security. Okay. Too far. Too far. That's good. That's good. Oh, okay. I, I literally bounced back with my size. That works. <laughs> oh. It's me. I'm a scientist. <laughs> Hello, Smasher. Your services have proven most useful. But we have even greater use of your abilities. You see, our employers have other plans for you. And why let such a perfect vessel go to waste? Or they could just go to your waste! That, that, that pun makes sense. If I just sit here... <laughs> other plans? Yeah, th these are the other plans, barely. Whis... Whis coming from disembodied lights on the floor. It is deep, and you're right. I'm just gonna sit here for a bit. <laughs> oh, it stopped. They ran out. <laughs> Smasher the Will will fix a game made for the 2020 Wake Gaming Game Jam by Creature Unknown. With music by Rayson Williams and from Dead Sound. Featuring characters designs by my patrons. Rahara, Dial, Mikey, Izzy, and Joe. Playtesters, but like Beerlog, a British Fox, Tower, PJNLY4, Lexel, thank you for playing the demo. Expect a more full version after the game jam judging concludes. So you're gonna expect you're so you're expanding on this. That's why there's all that river over there, I don't know. <laughs> so let's see, let's, let's go back to the first level. 
Short game. Actually, for uh, for games I'm playing by the pound, this actually has quite a bit of content to it. I guess I should say the game has quite a few calories compared to many of them. <laughs> good, good, good work, me dodging every single. Let me try that again. This is a demo. Yes, basically. Damn. They all accept that though if it sets me up. Actually, if I'm just gonna set up for the first shot, I should just. Wait, is this mini golf? Thanks, Fair. It only took you a half hour to figure that out. <laughs> yeah, actually, mini is not really the right word for it. Oh, Fair just got here? I thought you were here earlier. <laughs> I wish I could gain weight. I mean, most people can, technically. I was, but I had to leave for errands. Ah, fair enough. I don't think I can get par again. Oh, this is really hard, being par. There's no way I'm gonna get my... No? Almost, though. Wait. I think I got par. The bed still hates me. <laughs> Eat coal. <laughs> Too bad there's no hole in one pun the way that can be made here. Okay, I got par. That didn't get me anything, or did it? <laughs> ah. Rachel Scarf, Albatross are hard to unlock the skins for that level. Okay. Wait. I'll blow trust. <laughs> Alright, let's see here then. So I have to get under par then. Par is a good enough. How the hell do I. Five strokes for all this. Alright, let me think. How do I manage? I miss time that one every time I try that. I don't. I think going for the. I think I need to go this way for the first stroke. Oh, oh, that's good. That's good. More like it. Ah, oh, bugger. <laughs> I think. I think I have the right idea, let me try it. Yeah, but like, it, sometimes when I climb that wall, I don't go the direction I want to. The starting one can be just skips, because I'm going to instantly run into it regardless. My momentum is very hard to predict. Because physics, right? So it's not ever the same twice. It's not just parts change more with some one shot. So if you get four to one shot, I guess you seven thousand to four thousand. Each stroke under par just adds a thousand points. Oh, okay. Well, actually, this is good because I can. Uh... Yeah. Could shame that. <laughs> just hope this doesn't send me the wrong direction. All right, good. This, I'm gonna call you a bunch of stuff, so this is not gonna work out, but oh well. Oh, actually, no, it worked. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, come on. <laughs> I touched them, but I didn't touch them enough. Alright. <laughs> Big amount of wisp in one shot, sure. I guess? Par still matters, dude. So if I'm setting up for a big shot and wasting my time, wasting my shots, that could be bad, actually. That being said... Damn. Do not understand when a wall's gonna stop me or not. Okay. 
I'm actually trying to avoid now, I guess. You guys are insistent about a combo. Fine, hold on. Dude, there's so much wait time, though. So if I just drift into a wisp, I can't control that. Um, wait time. I mean, I'm just trying to set up. But it does waste my uh, stroke count to do so, so. Well, three looks like the best I can do there. I don't know if that's good enough, though. I don't know. The multiplier does increase exponentially, I suppose, but... You guys are suggesting a lot of things I don't know how to do though. It's like, oh, you know, just get forward a shot. Okay, yeah, there's tons of obstacles in my way that slow me down before I can actually collide with four things at once. So, sure. Still got the best score by just going under par. There are no obstacles to get the left first. I Couch, wall, 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 table. <laughs> what are you, crates, other table? Start just before the couch. What do you mean? Like... Yeah, that's another problem when people don't enunciate their words correctly. You mean you want me to set up like... A little far of a drift, but whatever. You're suggesting that this is a, this is still only a... Well, okay, that is a four combo, but how much was that? Was, I guess that could have been. That actually is pretty good, yeah. I also don't have an optimal strategy for doing this or anything. That's why I suggest not trying to get, like, super good... I just want the skins, yo. Or attempt to get them. I don't care about getting the high score, I just want the skins. I mean, get the one behind the couch to full... No! The couch is heavy! The couch blocks me! How are you not paying attention to this? It's... it's... The couch slows me the fuck down, dude. That's, like, literally not a setup that would work. That being said, let's see what this does for me. That's so extraordinary. That's probably better. The four combo made a big difference there. Was that a skin unlock? I don't really know. I don't know the ratings of the scores. Yes, it was. Okay, good. <laughs> Uh, let's see, but hold on a minute, I just thought about something. There's four levels. Oh, I see, I'm gonna lock multiple characters for some levels. Oh, whoa, <laughs> what did I do to the camera? <laughs> I, I'm just bouncing, it's like Pong. <laughs> um, alright, so... I mean, I could set up a... Th Three combo here pretty easily. Well, I say easily, but it require really specific timing. No. no not good enough. Definitely can set up a three combo. It, a four combo, nah, that's not it. If I broke all the walls, the four combo might be per perfectly possible with just the right setup, but I don't, I don't see that being... Woo, just skated it. I don't see that being very viable, so... This is going to be tricky. All right. Um. Tricky but doable. 
goodness me. I really wish I could. Yeah, you said you're going to add that to a new version. That's going to be good. But currently, I don't know where I'm going. So setting up a combo is a lot easier when I know where everything is. I, mean, I got to get that one in the garage. Okay, I can get a two combo here if I... This bed's really in my way, but let's see if I can just... Push it around. Oh, don't go too far. Oh, it's too far, isn't it? Yeah. Actually, a two combo might be difficult in my size. <laughs> well, a little... Get the three in the front room, go through the garage. Yeah, I'm thinking the garage next, yeah. I was thinking that too. I feel like I, I feel like this wall is gonna screw me over. How did I do that? How did I miss every single one? <laughs> That's a really good thread the needle, I suppose, but... Table! Alright, fine. The more physics objects in my way, the more less likely I'm going to go the direction I want to go. <laughs> Definitely need some power here, but too much is... Yeah, I just don't want to drift that. Well, at least I didn't move the table as much this time. Okay, I need to. I need to not go so high up. That's really the problem. I guess I'll aim more towards the table, like so. This is definitely an easier setup. Let's see if I can make this work. Damn it! Not quite. Precision is difficult. Damn it! Patience is also difficult. <laughs> Please just stop moving! Okay, that might be fine. So if I can't see the uh, I can't see the other one now. Hmm. Oh, let's see what happens. There we go. <laughs> All right, to the garage. Let's see if I can just. Okay, I guess that works. And then charge up and hit the one in the garage, I guess. And then hopefully, okay, I didn't quite set up for what I wanted, but I can get those two now as a combo, probably. Mm, stop. Okay. Right, they're they're literally in sync, so I know where they are gonna be. So I'll just. And it's pretty easy to hit two in a row, this size especially. And can I? I think I can. And I'm under par too. Of course, there's a beam literally in my. Oh my god, that's so fucking annoying. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, not under par because of that stupid piece of wood, but that was good enough, Albatross. So even a few two combos will help. <laughs> fucking, a fucking piece of wood. Play a shark. <laughs> Try a less wooden approach. How dare you? <laughs> no, it's it's fine. It's fine, creature. You made a physics space game. That means the physics are gonna do. That means there's always gonna be unpredictability. Something I might advise for the full version, though, um, for these like longer levels, since since there's always the possibility of some physics bungling something up that the player can't predict. Maybe have levels with a, maybe levels longer levels could have like a very limited number of restarts where you could rewind one shot if you didn't like the result of it. Like maybe one or two per level depending on the length. 
So if you just happen to get that unlucky shot that just messes everything up, you can rewind it and not have to restart the whole level. A mulligan, yeah, I guess so. Seems fair if the level's gonna be longer. Okay, I think it might be possible to get two right off the bat here. By just aiming correctly. I like that idea, but it's extremely hard to implement it because I'd have to record the save every fixed object. That's true. Well, granted, I guess you could just keep the physic. I guess you could keep things move slash broken on the rewind. That's an extraordinary. So I actually got the highest score on that first level. Cool. So I, I, I feel like it's possible if I just could fucking aim. No, it's not even aiming, it's timing. Timing's my issue. There. Yes, 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 drifted to it. Oh, that was very close. I know this is possible. I see the t shirts still work with me. I need to, I need to, not when it's there, when it's moving towards. Like, now. T-shirts bounce. Guard. I, I'm just gonna restart until I get these two at the beginning. Cause that, that early insurance will probably make it easier to do the rest of the level. Hmm. These levels are meant to be short enough that restarting them is not horrible. Uh, these last two levels seem a l I mean, the number of strokes you have to make, I feel like they are a bit long. Why am I- why am I mistiming this? Because I'm talking to you guys. Timing requires a metronome to go off in my head. And that metronome can't go if I keep talking. There. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, motherfucker. I know this is possible. I just need the physics objects to happen to bounce to be the right way. I'm gonna try aiming a little high. No, too high. I just wanna like scrape the edge of the wisp. Ideally. Oh. I think I just mistimed it. Not as bad as I usually did. Ah. Trying to aim up a bit more is just disadvantaging me. Another thing I recommend is perhaps a power meter. Because it's kind of, I'm like just pushing my mouse to the edge of the screen in hopes that I'm doing max power. A power meter would be pretty handy though, Dan, to kind of indicate how fast the player is going to be going. I. This is, yeah, that definitely is. Information is always useful. Assuming it's not. Spoiling something. And being able to scroll the map, which, yeah. I mean, you kind of had scrolling already with the right mouse. What did I do? Go then. Because I get, again, I'm talking. It throws off my timing. <laughs> We've had a few cases where I got very close to the way. It really is all down to the close. Let me try something, actually. But you already have scrolling, kind of. It's just it's locked a bit. So I'm sure that uh, simply implementing full scrolling is not really going to be that big of a deal. Okay, yeah, I do need to angle up. Just, just double checking. I want to see if I bounce weird or something. I don't even know if what I'm doing is technically possible. I'm starting to doubt this now. I feel like it, fe like it theoretically is, but...
You did it the first time you tried. I did? Maybe I could try bouncing a different way. A level tour type thing. That could be useful too, actually. I mean, I'd have to remember, but... No, I kind of have to go for this Whisper. There's no way I could bounce off of... Like... Well, I could set up... Well, actually... If I want to waste a stroke, I could just set up for it. That actually is not a bad... That gave me an idea, so hold on. No, no, no. Setting up for it... Actually, that... that what I did that first time was probably the, the best setup I can accomplish, actually. Yeah, probably so. Seat yourself where they meet. Well, this one goes all the way to here. This one goes all the way to here. Maybe. If I... See myself where they meet. I mean, I don't know. They are kind of far apart. Where, like, where they meet. They don't really meet. They kind of just... Exist in the same general vicinity for a second. Yeah, see? Unfortunately, that general vicinity may not be uh, big enough for me to take advantage of. I could try. Okay, that's like the best I can do, but there's still a big gap. Okay, that might work. That's not how I expected the clothes to fall over, but alright. Keep in mind, this is still just the beginning of the level. I still have to- whoops. Deal with the rest of the level after this. Actually, that might- that might work. There's a line I could set up, actually, if I ignore the clothes. Okay, well, I didn't really want to get behind that, but... Oh. Tubby, you're biased. <laughs> you're so biased. It is quite good, though. <laughs> this is, like, made for him. I, I, it, the fat, stilly thing is his fetish. Play by the pound, your series you're watching. <laughs> like, yeah, maybe I can eventually get this, but then I got the rest of the level to contend with, too. This is gonna be interesting. Damn it, those holes managed to bounce off of each other in a line. That worked perfectly against my favor. <laughs> That's weird. I'm just gonna go and see what. Ah, this is really getting kind of. Maybe I should not even. Man, I want to get a two combo here, but I don't know. Maybe it's not worth the fucking trouble. <laughs> I'm gonna try a few different things. and get the ones in the- yeah, but I can't see them. <laughs> that's the problem. I don't know where they're gonna- like, I could blindly shoot. That's true. Well, how though? There's so many clothes in my way. I don't think I can get this Wiss and make it to the other store. Yeah, look at that. I can't even get the Wiss. The clothes are just- these clothes are quite good denial of area uh, objects. <laughs> they, they do a lot to stop me. <laughs> No, don't go behind it. I think a two and two is possible. I just need to... That is actually like the most optimal setup for this. There! Fuck! <laughs> I did it. <laughs> now there's a ton of clothes in my way and I'm fucked. But, you know... <laughs> oh, I got, I got past them. Nice. And close enough to see my next setup, maybe? Okay, I think I know my next setup, but, uh, this may or may not work. 
Oh, it's not gonna work. Oh well. I mean, I guess this could have gone worse. Now I gotta get those guys first. Oh, this, this, if this, if this food bench stops me from hitting one of them. Oh wait, I got, no, you gotta get out, right, you gotta get out of the wisps first. I, for some reason, no, did not notice I missed one. No, yes, no. Oh well. However, I do know the line now, for the first, for this one, I mean. Now I just have to patiently wait for the physics to agree with the line. Maybe reduce my speed a little bit. That's really tricky to measure, but, you know. I don't know, it like getting kind of a medium speed, that's like the hardest thing. So I don't know exactly how hard to push it. Stop. Aw, oh, dang it. That was close. I know the position, just need to figure out the uh, power. Well, it's not quite the position, but... Are you kidding me, man? Okay, good. Eh, that could, could be a worse line, yeah. That's, that's, that's alright, I guess. I, I didn't go far enough. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Damn you, table! So after playing this game, can you tell I've never really played golf in my life? Golf plus physics is a very dangerous combination, my friend. I actually have played golf. Well, mini golf at least, which this is more pertaining to. Yeah, see, if I don't get that line perfect, that, that one close line just gets in my way. I must, yeah, I must just get past that close line without touching it. Okay, I think I need to angle more up this time if I can. I, I want to get to that other storefront if possible. So... Okay, yeah, that's that's fine, I guess. That's off the wall. Okay. Now, can I? Yeah. Good. Can I have enough speed to get that one? Yeah, easily. Right. Let's go for the wisp. Over. Okay. So. Yeah. Gotta start with that wisp, and then. Good. Good. Don't, don't leave the don't leave the building. <laughs> all right. Um. All right. So there's gonna be a clothesline messing me up here, isn't there? <laughs> no, actually a wall. But actually, you know what? Oh no 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 no. Oh, okay, we're fine. <laughs> Touch the escalator now. It suck. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Touch the escalator now would be great, but you know. All right, not to waste a bunch of strokes just trying to get up the damn escalator, I guess. As you do. The escalator is like the most frustrating object because it doesn't let you escape in any direction. All right, now we just wait. That's all I do now, I just wait.
I was wondering maybe with this combat one, it's too much. I'm surprised you not did it around so much and missed that. See, that's the thing. Like, if somebody's in the stream and then they go and then they come back, I don't know what they did or didn't catch at that point. I can't really keep track of that, so I get confused too. Is there a game played by the pound has multiple games? Yes. However, I would like to lock all the skins here. So. I'll get rid of it, sure. It's a gimmick, it's interesting, but it's still unlimited. Honestly, it's... If the escalator worked like the wind in the lab level, there wouldn't actually be any complaint for me. Because, uh... Yeah. Alright, now just, just get hurt. There we go. Because the wind is... The wind lets you leave it, <laughs> basically. <laughs> hey, I got the max score. I guess I did get quite a bit under par, actually. Cool, we unlocked three skids, which I will be cycling through as I struggle through the lab. <laughs> I feel like the lab... I don't actually know what the... I don't even know the actual proper way through the lab yet. <laughs> okay, first off, we're just gonna shove ourselves through the desk, I guess? I mean... Wow, okay. Around it, then. Stupid heavy desk. Okay, that... Really hoping that wall would ricochet me a bit, but it just uh, didn't. So let me. Uh... All right, that's that's okay. That's a decent setup. There's a two combo here. I must hit. Yeah. This level is vaguely an RNG nightmare. I, I, I actually already knew when I first played it that it's going to be an RNG nightmare for for this goal. Oh, don't bounce that far back. You're not even fat yet. Why are you, so, why are you bouncing so much? <laughs> okay, you're chubby, but... Bounce. It's like, uh, if, I ba if I aim too far away and miss the desk, then I just bounce right off the wall. I need to actually hit the desk, but not too much! Oh, I, I like how I turn it exactly 90 degrees. Um... Okay. Can I make this work? One. Well, yes, I can. No. Okay, there's a four combo there if the RNG wants to like me. But that's. Oh no, I can't see where they are though. Oh, I see the real RNG here. I can't tell you where those are gonna be. I have to shoot and hope I am in the line of it. Basically, <laughs> that was so close to being right. All right, well at least it's right at the beginning of the level, and I hope I can fuck up enough if I get this four combo that the rest of the level won't be that bad. I mean, I'm just gonna struggle through the rest of the level and hope it's uh, a good line, a good setup. Damn it! All right. I guess I aimed a little too far left. Well. This position bad, actually. Ooh, ooh. Well, there's no way I'm making this work. There's a very specific position I need to be in. Maybe if I hit the desk a little lighter. No. Okay, I like how I can't get through the desk if I just aim right at it, but now I'm just trying to softly hit it, I'm going right through it. Just stop. Let the desk stop you. Holy shit. <laughs> no, stop drifting! Why? Lose your momentum, goddammit! <laughs> Alright, hold on. Just, like... Of course, that's not enough. <laughs> like, now I want to lose momentum and I can't do it. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Kind of. I think I can make that work. Yeah. 
All right, RNG Nightmare, let's see what you can do. All right, they weren't even there. <laughs> I do see the perfect line. Like, we almost had that first try through there, but... I'm also scared of sharks. He's... Look, his boyfriend's a shark. He might be biased. Yeah? Motherfuck! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's just sad. Nope. See, the thing is that well, the, the shrinking thing makes me small, so it also makes it more precise to actually- oh, too far. It makes it more precise to actually run into the wisps. <laughs> my, all my skins are my patrons, including Lexel. You just have a lot of sharks that like you. Moment of truth. I did it! All right, now seriously, what's the best way to go about this area? Should I backtrack? Yeah, I probably should go this way first, right? Well, I kind of hmm. Go to the right first. Okay, yeah, actually, because the door won't open until I get all the the, the wisps. Fix. Wait. Oh, I didn't. Okay, whatever. I'm just gonna break the wall. Okay. That I'm a little concerned about bumping this, but um, this might work. This, we'll, just, we'll just have to see. And go. That'll that'll do. Yeah, that'll do. Oh, this this is gonna be a hard line to set up though. Perhaps if I. Simply. Alright, well, I'm not gonna get those two, but whatever. Let's hope my score is good enough. Yeah, there's no way I could set up a line here. That's not possible. I don't remember where- what's down- oh, here, uh... Okay, no, setting up a line with this doesn't make sense, I'll just grab it. Welcome, Cece. Uh, now what the hell should I do here? There's a wisp floating through here, there's a wisp over here. I don't know where everything else is. Down, right, left. Down, right, left? I mean... Maybe actually wait, they do meet up, don't they? Or is that just just go for the aim for the white? Yeah, I guess so, because I don't want to get stuck in that room. That wasted me some strokes before. <laughs> Clipboard, jeez. <laughs> Alright, well I'm gonna bring 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 in a table with me, but. I, please, I know I'm in the wind, but could could I get, can I, can I, can I, can I, no, it's gonna wait for me to get out of the wind before I can do anything. I, I can't shoot until, uh, the wind. That's weird, because I could shoot on the escalator, but not in the wind. Alright. Oh, bugger. Well, actually, it's fine. What? Bye, table! <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> This is a little awkward. Okay, there. There, got it. Doesn't matter. <laughs> Good thing ate time. Don't even speak of such things. Alright, I think there's... These two are parallel? Oh, that's actually a good spot, because I can push off like that. Yeah, there. Uh, yeah, okay, they're parallel, so... That is an amazing miss I just did. Again, really fucking hope it's high enough score. 
At least I got two out of the three, but... Oh, the wind has me, I, I can th think. <laughs> Alright, I'll just take a drink. Okay, it kind of had me, but... I swear to God, if I had somehow missed that whist, I would have been just like, what? I'm quite under par and I did okay. Let's hope it's enough. Thanks again for the cabio, by the way. <laughs> Appreciate that. Holy, you were a skip. I'm not a patron backer, though, so it's understandable. Oh, I got the max ranking, so I guess I did okay. <laughs> I'm a smart pupper. I pretend I know science. <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna go, like, I don't know, this level. <laughs> Whoops, I forgot to change the skin first. I'm gonna look at all the skins. <laughs> Back to map. He's just there for the rose serums. Probs. Probs. <laughs> this is a pretty well put together package for a jab game. Quite honestly, you did a good job on this. Anyways, I'm just gonna screw around and get big with each of the characters. I don't tell really made goat boys popular, huh? Like, I did not see that many goat furries before Undertale, and then Undertale, and then millions of goat furries. Not that I'm complaining, goats are cool. But there was like no goats before that. <laughs> Delta really did. No, I'm, I'm gonna play both, if anything, equally. Bleat's a good blo goat. Bloat a good goat. <laughs> Quote for the last day. Shit, shit, I need some scientists. Uh, Charm, hey, are you okay being Anthro being a cameo? Thank you, thanks, bye. I don't, I don't go Anthro a ton, but it's totally a viable option for me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I remember that conversation. The beam clip through the wall. I mean, it is a physics space game, so, and I'm playing it, so eventually I need to have a physics glitch through a wall. That's just how it works. Sure, good thing I don't have to worry about high scores right now. But I got all the skins unlocked, so I consider that 100%. I mean, I guess I didn't get maximum score on every level, because I think this level I got Albultross. Did I get fats on all the others, though? I can't remember. I'll have to check on the map screen. So, like I said, I wasn't going for high score, I just wanted to lock the skids. This is like what it's like to be the Kool Aid Man. But the Kool Aid Man isn't fat. And now I realize that there's probably somebody that did fat art of the Kool Aid Man. Missed. Yeah, the, yeah, actually, yeah, if I had- oh, <laughs> speaking of getting things through the wall, jeez louise. Yeah, if that one piece of wood hadn't screwed me up when I actually was going for the score in this level, I would have gotten fat, so you're right. That beam, it didn't even, it didn't even seem like there was a wall when I was doing that. Okay, well, I'll try to get the max score in this one. I do appreciate how you made the last unlock the, the... Lizard boyfriend, good. That is good. What was the setup for this again? 
I mean, I could try. This level is a lot shorter than the ones that were really tough, so... Ah, it's not the right line. <laughs> Cecilia, you, you doubt the possibilities. You could also argue Sans can't do Vor, he's a skeleton, but people figured that out. <laughs> I think that was the line. Was that the line? I think that was the line. Just need to get it through. The other way? I guess I could. Wait, no, that's not true. Well, I mean... There's no... I was like, imagine a four combo here, but I'm like, nah. Nah, I was, I was doing the best line. Whoa! Like I can rotate the camera weirdly if I just like do that and just like oh it just it just has momentum now. <laughs> it's just momentum. <laughs> Sans drinks ketchup. I didn't play Undertale. Well, let's see a skin by CH. A some people. Wow, that's actually a lot of skins. <laughs> I guess it's not too difficult to implement, as long as... Damn it! Even trying to hit it lightly, I go too far. Okay, power meter will be really nice in the, in the final version. Oh, there, there. That's, that's, that's an okay line. Timing of these things are a little off from each other, though, so this might be tricky. Gotta wait for the right moment. The right moment to strike. Hope to have the full version done by New Year's. Well, once the full version's out, do let me know. I'll, I'll, I'll take a look. I'm not super dupe. Like, there's the weight. Weight gaming is a is a forum. It, this is where it's actually where I've gotten quite a few games, so it's very valuable. Mm. <laughs> but. I don't check it super duper often because every time I go over there, I have to dig through. You see, I actually could have even more games uh, for this for playing by the pound if I accepted human games, because weight gaming has a lot of human games. Thing is, though, I'm not really as big on those. I actually do have a couple human games that I just thought were interesting. Uh, I think in in the list, but generally speaking, I'm like, nah, fam. I want the furries. <laughs> Uh, weight game is kind of garbage because it's very female human centric. It's honestly the same as Echo's Portal. That regard. I'm not gonna call them garbage though, because like you know I get it. People are into that, but like I feel like there's an overabundance of female human vor focus with people, and it's just kind of boring to me. Like that's the most boring form of vor. If you like it, that's cool. Go right ahead and like it. I'm not judging, you know. But like, it's just like the most boring form. At least with, like, furry furry, you got all sorts of species coming up, you know? It's not just human and human and slightly different looking human and this human looks like the other human because the humans are fucking boring after a while. But you know what I mean. <laughs> hey. I don't think humans are yucky. I just think that he female human stuff is kind of really very boring. This is the same complaint I have towards anime. Where all the, you know, all the cute girls just over and over again. Oh, I found green lines. What did I do? I think I broke some. I think I uh, I broke between the tiles of the of the map somehow. Neat. <laughs> um. Not fluffy, fat face, no flat face, no tail. Horrible. See, this is why I'm actually pretty partial to demis because that's basically taking humans, which I don't think are bad, but they can be kind of boring. But then you add traits to them that make them less boring and more unique. So I like demis quite a bit. Ooh, whoa! What did I do with the? Oh my goodness! Look at my mouse position. Look at my mouse position, and look at where I'm aiming. Something weird happened here. Uh, I guess I'll put it like. Yeah? Okay, wait, I lost it? It unlocked for me. That was weird. Well, something really weird happened. I don't know what I did, but that was really bizarre. And then I let go and I didn't shoot. At least I don't think I did. Did I waste a stroke? I don't think I did. 
What a bizarre situation that was. <laughs> Charm happened. This is a true statement. I'm very good at bug testing. I'm very good at bug testing because I find all the bugs. <laughs> Without even trying, because I just... I just... This is just how I play games? Alright, let's just charge. And... Now! Oh, I think this looks good. Your thoughts are cold, let's fucking love them. Well, I'm like to jump down dragon's throats. It's good times. Also, yeah, there we go. Fatso extraordinaire. Fatso, fatso at every level. There you go. I, I, there's my high scores, too. Feel free to try to beat them. You probably can, but there you go. You can see everyone there. <laughs> if you do meet your, my scores, uh, good, good, good work. It probably required a really diff difficult shot, or just managed to get less strokes between the shots I did. Um, other than the changes we talked about, what do you think? Anything you'd like to see before I leave? Uh, I would like to see you experiment with more gimmicks. I do like the idea of gimmicks. The escalator may have not have been that fun, but I like the idea of gimmicks. I like the uh, shrinking mechanic too. Um, just try to focus on gimmicks that work well with the physics engine. Gimmicks that allow the player some leeway with how they operate. That's definitely what I recommend. When you have a physics-based game, the game should always have some leeway because you always gotta consider, well, the physics might do something unpredictable. So that unpredictability should be factored into the design decisions. In other words, make sure the things are make sure your wind conditions are not super precise if you got physics involved, basically. Um, allow allow that possibility of well, if this fucks up, I'll allow for this, you know. Um, work on the push pull mechanics a little. I have to say the ricochet aspect of the character is a bit different than I thought. Granted, he is different from a golf ball. Golf ball is hard, so if it hits a wall, it's gonna ricochet off uh, in a angled fashion. Meanwhile, a fat jelly. Floofy, be floofy belly creature like we have in this game. Well, that may have a uh, different physics, so I don't bl I don't mind that. That's that's actually fine. Um, hmm. Let's see. What what else would be good? Well, like I said, the mulligan thing might be good on some levels. Uh, definitely make you know. Uh, if, if, if you don't allow for a free camera to look around the entire level, then yeah, at least a pan at the beginning of the level. Uh, just show the level. Uh... Hmm. Perhaps a bonus objective would be kind of cool. Like, it could be separate from the whole story. It's just I've been trying to get under par. But like, maybe some sort of like special collectible, on one on each level that requires... Um... Hmm, some sort of like specific setup to get or something. And the difficulty is just acquired it, not worrying about the par for it. It can be acquired separately from getting the best score. Uh, that's an idea. Ice cream, can't go wrong with ice cream. I mean, yeah, that's true. Hmm. What what else? I don't know. I'm I don't I'm I'm not exactly bursting as much of these guys as waistlines with uh, with ideas. This is pretty good so far. I would just say, say, kind of say, stay, stay the course and keep introducing new gimmicks. Also, I do like the fact that every level has a completely different look. That's very solid. I appreciate that. Um, hmm. What about you guys, audience? What do you suggest? Let's see. How about making some? Link says, "How about making some of the obstacles obstacles can be destructible, so they aren't always in the way." Yeah, it could be nice if some of this stuff broke apart. Um, when I hit it, like the plank that messed me up during that one run where, where it prevented me from getting the uh, Fatso Extraordinary rank on sub Subburpia. Oh, by the way, I didn't really appreciate the names of these levels. Girth of a Hero, Subburpia, Rolling Acres, and Lard Lab. Very good. Bonus points for destruction? Actually, that would be kind of neat. Growth shakes could, yeah, that's true. Alternate goals are specific to each level in order to lock more skins, get mighty buy skins because there's so many. That's it. That's good. Yeah, like weird little objective, like run into all the clothes racks or something. I don't know. And there's an axolot on the YCH version, and no moths. I'm definitely afraid of moths. 
You have offended Beerus. <laughs> you have offended the Beerus. <laughs> I actually didn't know there was a phobia of moth. That's it's that's interesting. Yeah, good, see you later, Blooded. And good work on this. But, uh, yeah. That was the uh, August 2020 Gain, Gain Jam version of Smasher and the Will of the Wit Fix. And I guess we'll be looking out for the final version, or a full version, later on. So, I'll probably come back to this. Well, the full version of it. But yeah, that was pretty fun. 